In today's video, we are going to look at seven signs and symptoms of throat cancer. Throat cancer refers to cancer that starts in the pharynx or larynx, but can also refer to cancer that starts in the esophagus or thyroid. So, throat cancer arises when cells in these areas undergo mutations in their DNA, leading to uncontrolled cell growth that can form a tumor. So, with time these cancerous cells can invert nearby tissues and thereafter spread to other parts of the body. These cancers are located in either the larynx or pharynx. The larynx, also called voice box, allows people to speak. The pharynx is a tube that runs down from the back of the nasal cavity, connects with oral cavity, and then with the esophagus and trachea. The pharynx is involved in both breathing and swallowing. Now, you have types of throat cancer like number one, oropharyngeal cancer, which forms in the oropharynx. They are where the pharynx and the mouth connect. It's most common in the United States. Number two, nasopharyngeal cancer, which arises in nasopharynx, which sits behind the nasal cavity. It's most common in Asia. Number three, Hypopharyngeal cancer is another rare form of throat cancer. The hypopharynx connects with the larynx. Number four, laryngeal cancer. It impacts the larynx or the voice box. The voice box contains the vocal cords and allows us to speak. Now, in this video, you are going to understand the seven signs and symptoms of throat cancer. So let's explore one by one. Number 1. Persistent cough. It might be a sign of throat cancer when it lasts for long, and it may signal more signs when one starts splitting blood when coughing. When one coughs, it may lead to headache, nosebleeds, and facial pain due to stretches of muscles and nerves. This cough may hinder some of your day-to-day -day activities, thus it's communicating something that you need to take serious before it's too late. Number 2. Changes in voice. People develop a voice disorder for many reasons. A voice disorder is a change in how the voice sounds. The voice box, also called the larynx, is made of a smooth covering, muscles, and soft and moist areas. So when one produces a hoarse voice for more than three weeks and also a weak voice that lasts longer, it is a common sign of throat cancer or other related diseases. See your doctor for proper diagnosis of the diseases. Number 3. Difficulty swallowing. It is also one of the signs that might signal early signs of throat cancer due to some sores around the throat. Sometimes difficulty swallowing along with pain can be a symptom of an allergic reaction. The most common causes of difficulty swallowing is usually the results of damage to the esophagus or poor function of the nerves and muscles that control swallowing. There is when throat cancer comes in due to some damages caused to either lymph nodes of the throat. When you see this kind of sense, visit your doctor for treatment. Number 4. Ear pain. It is easy for you to assume ear discomfort as something normal, hence expecting it to vanish as mysteriously as it appeared. However, it is important to understand what your body is trying to communicate to you. So, when you see this kind of pain which concentrates on one side and it doesn't show any sense of ear infection, it might be sounding early signs of throat cancer that you yourself should take it seriously. Some are wondering how can ear pain be a sign of throat cancer. The ear has intricate network of nerves connected between the ear and the throat. Thus, when the cancer appears in throat, it leads to persistent pain. When you see this kind of signs, it is good you visit your doctor so that he or she can come up with a diagnosis. Number 5. Weight loss Unexplained weight loss that appears gradually without changing your lifestyle or going for an exercise to reduce weight, it may be an early warning sense of throat cancer that signals you that there might be a problem with your body. So these symptoms become particularly alarming when it's rapid and indented. 
Not only weight loss, it might be showing throat cancer signals, but it can also show other health related issues such as difficulty swallowing of food, which might be a challenge during absorption. Also, it could be an increased metabolic demand by the body as it tries to fight off the cancer. Therefore, when you see this kind of signs, it's good you visit a nearest health center for early treatment or diagnosis. Number 6 A lump in the throat. When you discover a lump whether by chance or you have started feeling something developing along your throat that feels somehow hard and feeling painless whenever you touch it, it could be a warning signal of throat cancer or other related diseases that might have caused a lump. With all symptoms we have discussed, a lump is most tangible since you can feel it and know what your body is trying to communicate. When you see such a sign, it's good you visit a healthcare center for early diagnosis and treatment. Number 7. Swollen Lymph Nodes There are always small bean-shaped organs that are part of the lymphatic system and immune system. When you come across cold or an infection around your throat and they appear, now those are the lymph nodes. Also, lymph nodes are known as cervical lymph nodes. So, lymph nodes in the neck help filter lymph fluid which contains damaged cells and germs and destroy invader. They also produce immune cells to help fight infection. Therefore, when throat cancer appears, they become swollen. When it's an infection, swollen lymph nodes are usually temporary and harmless and they typically return to normal shortly after the infection goes away. So when you see your lymph nodes have stayed enlarged for longer than a few weeks, you might have a history of cancer. Now, when you start discovering the above mentioned signs symptoms of throat cancer, it's good you visit a healthcare profession for early diagnosis so that early treatment may start.